Hello, in this tutorial I will show how to create iOS app using ChatGPT. We will create a meditation app for iOS. And the first thing we ask ChatGPT to do is generate an idea for our app. What functionality should the app provide to its users? Let's see if ChatGPT can help us find the answer to this question. As you can see, ChatGPT described a very solid concept of a meditation app. You can add features from this description to your roadmap. For our example, we focus on building a simple app that allows the user to set the timer and play music during the meditation session. Information architecture is next on our list. A navigation system of our app should be based on solid information architecture, so we first need to specify what screens our mobile app will have. Let's see if ChatGPT can help us with that. ChatGPT shares a structure for a more complex and sophisticated product. It can be a good idea to keep this information architecture in mind when we add more features to our product in the next version. Colors are next on our list. Colors play an essential role in a meditation app. Since colors directly impact how we perceive products, we want to use colors that help users relax. Let's ask ChatGPT what colors it can recommend for our product. Let's open Figma and see how the suggested colors look in the design. As you can see, the color scheme is created primarily from neutral colors. This scheme is helpful, especially if you play with the opacity of individual colors. Now let's create fonts for our app. Well-selected fonts can create a positive impression on app users. When we interact with a meditation app, we might expect to see rounded fonts because they are easy for the human eye and create a more friendly visual appearance. When creating a product, I typically choose between two font pairs by comparing them side by side. So I will ask ChatGPT to provide two font pairs. Although ChatGPT provided solid arguments about font pairing, the final result doesn't look very visually appealing. It doesn't feel like the fonts work well with each other for this particular type of a product, especially the first combination of Open Sans and Playfair Display. Can ChatGPT generate background music for our app? Music is a core part of the meditation procedure. Well-selected music will put the user in the right mood and make them feel calm. Unfortunately, ChatGPT is a text-to-text -text tool that cannot generate any media content, but it can share a textual description for types of music that will work well for the meditation app. The meditation script is the next on our list. If you want to maximize the effect of the exercise, you need to find the right words and read them in a calm manner and soothing tone so that they allow listener to relax and focus on each part of their body. As you can see, ChatGPT generates a solid script that can be used for the meditation session. Once we have fonts, colors, and content, it's time to create functional elements. And timer will be the first functional element in our list. A timer will help us to run the meditation session. It's important to mention in a prompt that we want to generate code for Swift Playground because it will make it easier to try this code in Xcode. Let's test what ChatGPT generated for us. Launch Xcode and create a new playground project. Replace the default code with the code generated by ChatGPT. Let's run the code. As you can see, the code is functioning correctly. Now that we know that ChatGPT can help us create individual components for the app, we might wonder whether it can write us an entire app from a single attempt. We asked ChatGPT to generate a meditation app that has two screens. The first screen has a button, and when the user clicks it, they see the next screen with the remaining time. Note that I explicitly specified Swift UI in the prompt. 
I want ChatGPT to generate a code in Swift UI. Let's test what ChatGPT generated for us. Launch Xcode and create a new project. Add code that ChatGPT generated and copy the code for the home screen to the content view. As you can see in the device preview, the code is functioning correctly. ChatGPT generated code and provided some instructions on how to use it. However, it completely ignored a part of the prompt about a meditation app. But we can change how we interact with ChatGPT and ask the tool to provide detailed step-by-step -step instructions on building a Swift app. Once we receive a guide, we can go step by step and ask ChatGPT to provide detailed information for each action we need to take. Use a step from a guide as a prompt for ChatGPT. If you have any questions about ChatGPT, please leave a comment. And if you like this video, hit a like button. Thank you.